If you were to shoot your video, videos and you had this and like there's no games in the background, what would you have there? What would you have there? You look like you would look, look like a freaking post. adult. You wouldn't look like a kid with a game room. I still see your games on a shelf. I know. I'm not an adult. I'm not claiming. <laughs> Just because I'm judging you doesn't mean I'm not judging I'd love myself. To be Welcome. This is season six. It's bright AF outside. Right now, I'm on my way to pick up Ian and Lester, and the only thing on our agenda is that I gotta go to IKEA so that I can buy some lights for my display cabinet in my office. I've been over the winter break. If you follow us on Twitter and on Facebook, one of my projects were to uh, kind of not transform the game room, but make it a nice environment to house a lot of my collection. Hardest thing about shooting videos in the winter time is turning off the heat so that the microphone doesn't register the vent. And I'm a little sick. Yo, it's the new Ed Sheeran. Jump on it. No. Oh. It's on. It's recording. So. Is this really Ed Sheeran? Yeah, it's his new song. It came out like two days ago or so. Sounds like he's sold out. <laughs> Lester's got a next switch. Order. Are you willing to pay? No. <laughs> Four hundred bucks for glorified tablet holder, yeah, right? There's a reason we take the GoPro out when we video blog instead of the big ass camera. This is a little easier to hide when you don't want people to know you're recording stuff. <laughs> you know when <laughs> hot girl walks by. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, I'm all like, it's gone. Look at that. Mmm, smells like MDF. Ooh, look at this chair. She got a chain. That's a like like comfortable chair holder. Yeah. Or you got just that chest thing, and you just walk around. Just a chest mount. <laughs> so I love IKEA. A chest mount. Anyway, <laughs> are you saying I have cleavage? I can put in my cleavage. <laughs> Jerk. Here's a hack for you guys. This is the TV bench lack. People have used this for you know small office game rooms, right? There was a guy called Nintendo Collecting Lithium. He took this. And he put decals of a Nintendo Wii controller. Welcome to the Nintendo room. The last table that I have in here is this Wii remote table. The Wii remote table is a perfect size. It's from Ikea. This is a lac table. I know, it's pretty corny. But <laughs> he put like, you know, the, the D-pad here, yeah. the two little home buttons, and then the 8BA. It looked like a Nintendo controller. That's if funny. you're into corny stuff like that, that's, cool. that's corny, I know. Or he bought a round table and put a Pokemon ball on it. Yeah. So creative. Shots fired at lithium. I can't tell. Shots fired with hearts. With hearts. <laughs> this one is recommended by Jeremy, who's helping us with our video for season six. East Coast operations for Thrift Fellow. The Detolf display cabinet. 60 bucks. I think I 60 bucks now, right? nice. It's a good price. This is the regular price, too. I bought mine on sale for $49.99. But, anyways, if you want to see it, here it is. I would love to have a whole wall of this shit, but I think I gotta buy statues first. Oh, here are the Is lights. The lighting you need? I didn't realize they were only eight ninety nine. It's only one light though in there. You just mount one at the top, and that's it. Mm. I kind of want one on each level, you know. Yeah, I see what you mean. Doesn't that look weird though? What? When you see like the the, the, cord <coughs> and the wires. You would have to hide it, obviously. But it's all glass. How do you hide that? You, well, you see the cord at the top, and you'll see it on the glass, but you run it down the edges. Any other hacks that we can come up with, Lester? That's three tips. Make, uh, it's three tips we've given headphone on this stands, video. Headphone stands, headphone stands. We already did that hack in the car. We okay. Told uh, oh, oh, you need CD storage? This was a good Malum drawer. See? Malum. You need CD storage? These are great for CDs. If you don't, if you don't want to be corny like us and put your games on the shelf and shit, Put it in here like and close it. Yeah. yeah. Like and then like perfect. from a distance this is all you see. So imagine you had three of these all together and then you're stereo Oh even games. Oh, no, you what you do is do, take for three of these. Not for all your CDs. No, it's not. But like <laughs> just saying, eh? Yeah. No, you buy three of these and just put your CRT or your TV above it. Yeah. Where's all your games? <laughs> it's like <laughs> And not only that, you can put your controllers and shit. Yeah, that's true. So your room could be super clean with just Malum drawers. If I could redo my room, Malums. I like the way games look on the shelf. Though. I know, because we're corny like that. 
We're corny. If, if you were to shoot your video, videos and you had this and like there's no games in the background, what would you have there? What would you have there? You, you, you look like you would look like a freaking post. adult. You wouldn't look like a kid with a game room. <laughs> hey, you're supposed to, you know, nostalgia. Back to our childhood. When I was a kid, you like feeling like a kid. That's okay, my computer desk, Lester. <laughs> when I was a teenager, my computer desk, I could put everything that I could to make it look cool, right? Yeah. The older I'm getting, the less I want to put on my computer yeah. desk. I want it to be clean, you know, like clean. out of sight, out of mind, functional. You know, that shelf looks clean too. You gotta balance it out, I guess. You can't put everything out, though, in my yeah. opinion. Okay. Put on display your your best games, like in a freaking adult, Ian. <laughs> be an adult. Put your vinyl on those. I still see your games on the shelf. I know, I'm not an adult, I'm not claiming <laughs> You wanna double the space of your game room? Make it look bigger <laughs> with a mirror. <laughs> it's like I have double the collection. <laughs> That's a cool set light. That's nice, eh? Like you workers looking at our camera. <laughs> It's like, you can't film in here. Oh, that's probably why. She saw you, She's Ian. Like, oh. Smiled at Ian. There you go. This is the Ledberg, LED Berg. This stuff is what I, this is what I have in my game room here. Where's the, but it comes with this thing here. You can control the, uh, but it's not on. Right? Yeah. Because this only comes with three or four, eh? And then it would take maybe... If I wanted to do one whole one, it would take at least five or six. I like this song, by the way. Yeah, me too. <laughs> so they come in a pack of three? Uh, these? So these do, but the oh, colored yeah. ones come in fours. Okay, what would you do? I go with multiple. Absolutely. It's not cheaper. No. This is fourteen ninety nine. That's twenty four. This is thirty nine ninety nine. Oh. If you want to make your Nintendo Power magazines look, you know, like an adult <laughs> instead of a kid, right there. Magazine holder thingies. These are called the uh, Fajalas. Right? Fajala. Get a Fajita. <laughs> Yeah, I'd like 6,000 chicken fajitas, please. 50 different dollar animals. one million. So we got to Thirsty's Flea Market. Parking lot is ridiculous. And apparently it's not like customers. They're the people who, who work at the flea market, so. Boo to the guy who runs Thirsty's Flea Market. Probably the most ridiculous parking lot I've ever seen. Sweet. That is pretty sweet. Look at this place. Video games. This is ridiculous. Who invests in this stuff? I don't know. Crazy people. I'll buy it all off you. Yeah, 50 bucks. 50 bucks for everything? What do you want? Yeah, sure. Right. How about 40? 40. 40. I like this thing. I was looking this up online. It is really expensive. Yeah. Farm toys. See this good oh, customer yeah. service here. They're fully stocked here now. Oh yeah, man. Uh, I don't know. Just Capcom. Maybe Capcom just made it then. Oh, because I was looking. There's a couple. You ever hear of first four figures? Mm, oh, space. No. Mega they make really nice uh, yeah. Mega Man statues. Or hang on safari. Hang on safari. Look at this. Records, eh? Records are for losers. <laughs> right, Lester? Depends. See these where it's at. It depends. 
Depends. Look at there's a comic book based on me. <laughs> Look. Look at this. Is that from, that's from Little Lulu, I think, I guess. What's Little Lulu? Never mind. <laughs> Anyways, this guy's store is pretty crazy. Captain's Collectibles. Look at that. Oh, sorry. But I saw down here Star Trek stuff. Was it cool? Got an Endorian and other things there. Anyways. <laughs> Kirk. Captain Kirk, are you? It's awesome. I just buy these records for the covers, most of them. You think this is where the good music is? Oh, that's what I said. Most of the black music is in this corner. Yeah, look, he has more shit in here. So show real quickly what you got there. Just oh, uh, Eric Bean Rickon, move the crowd. Are you getting it? No. no. Put it on the like, uh, like, uh, the other one. Oh, and then the, the single for Rhythm Nation. Oh, nice. <laughs> that was in fashion. It was but, hot. Yeah, it, you just get these for the covers, though. Yeah. 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 Ian, what did you get today? <laughs> I got Gordon Lightfoot, Sundown, good Canadian artist. He looks like light pants. <laughs> Lester, what did you buy today? Orange juice, Minute Maid, two for four bucks a co-op. We literally just shot this and it was recording. <laughs> I bought some He-Man comics, but I'm going to end this video blog by me installing the lights on my, my uh, display cabinet in my office. Literally just said all that. <laughs> yeah, you did. Literally. Literally. I bet you the lighting is better here. So, this is what my cabinet would have looked like before. The IKEA lights. And bam! Um... Are you as underwhelmed as I was with that? I thought there'd be like tons of light. These are the lights I bought. And I had to make some janky ass system where... Like, cause these, these shelves are not Ikea shelves, but even the Ikea shelves, I don't think were built to put these lights up. So you can see here I put some black duct tape to kind of hide those wires that stuck out like a sore thumb. You know, and this spot here is waiting for Thanos, which is right there, which was, I was about to, I was supposed to record an unboxing and reviewing of that for my other channel, but I had to get my wisdom teeth taken out, you know? So it's been about, um, so it's been about six days, seven days since I've last seen you guys. And yeah, that, this is, that was supposed to be the end. So that was the end of that. So that's the end of that video with them. And I'm starting a new video blog today. It's my first time venturing out into the wild, wild cold of Winnipeg. I heard that our roads are like sheets of ice.